Hey, what's going on everybody? Cholo Reefer here. So I'm trying to get this damsel out of my tank and uh, I don't want to move all the rocks. I don't want to make a mess. So I went with this method. I, I looked up a couple to see what the best method was and I I feel like this one's the, the best, best method for my tank. So I went out to Walmart, got a, um, a pet carrier. I drilled a couple holes in it and look, you can see my rasp going in there right now. Um, I drilled a couple holes in it and I put it in there and the important thing is you have to leave it in there for a couple of days to get the fish used to it being in there so they're not afraid of it. So I just put a rock in there to kind of hold it in place because I have a, if, I don't know if you can see the string holding up the little door, but I have it holding up the door. I put the, the rock in the PVC so that they can go in there and feel comfortable, hide in the PVC maybe. Uh, but yeah, I'm, I'm trying this out. Cora Beauty and the, the rafts are messing around in there. There goes the goby. Uh, but our goal is the damsel because he's being really aggressive with some of my other fish. He's not letting the uh, the clownfish uh, swim around throughout the tank. They're, they're just being really aggressive and uh, the wife wants him out. So uh, hopefully here we'll, we'll catch him. Let's see how we do. Push him in there, clown. Come on, you know you want to join the party. Oh, I think that's going to push him over. He sees all that food flying around they just knocked up. He's gonna get in there. He's gonna get in there. Let's go. Let's go. Now's your time. Now's your time. The rest is out. Now's your time.
Yes! Oh my god, that took so long. Oh, I uh, finally got him. I finally got the little turd. Yes.